What's going on everybody, Krahu here, and I have a round of free for all on launch. One of my favorite maps in the game, Call of Duty Black Ops. Um, so yeah, in this one I'll be rocking the AK-74U with a silencer, uh, followed by a Python revolver as my secondary. And I just sounded like a fucking infomercial. Okay, perks, lightweight, um, ninja, and sleight of hand. And this whole entire game, I thought I was rocking Ghost. You know that perk that's like cold blood on minor one for two? Yeah, that. I thought I was rocking ghost. So when I heard, you know, enemy spy plane, I was like, meh, I don't give a shit. You know, they, they can't see me. Are you sure about that? Yeah, are you sure about that, 2010 Krahu? Because 2020 Krahu clearly sees that you're using lightweight. And that's not going to help you against UAVs. What are you doing? It was a decade ago. What's going on guys, Krahu here, and what you just heard in the beginning of this video was Krahu from 10 years ago. First and foremost, thank you very much, however you found your way to this video, maybe you're watching 10 years from now when YouTube finally recommends it, uh, but thank you so much for clicking, thank you so much for watching, um, welcome back, that's all I can say, and before we move in, oh, sick dolphin dive bro, before we move on to anything else, I would like to invite you guys to uh, my Twitch channel, my Twitch.tv channel, it's in the description. Be sure to follow me there because there's good stuff coming and I have a lot to talk about in this video. But again, thank you so, so much for um, sticking by this channel and I don't know, maybe randomly you um, stumble upon this in your subscription box and you decided to click. Thank you so much. Um, again, I have a lot to talk about this video so I'm not going to waste any time. Um, so check out my description for all the goodies, uh, my Twitter and my Twitch. Be sure to check out that Twitch channel. Um, so I wanted to release this video earlier, but as luck would have it, first of all, my PC crapped out over the summer. Second of all, my PS3 crapped out. It's, it was just a whole thing. So I wanted to talk about Black Ops 1 because... Soon it's going to be a decade, literally. I think Black Ops 1 came out on November 9th? Actually, you know what? Let's give it up. Let's give it up for Black Ops 1. Fucking 10 years old. Good on you, old man. I'm old. I turned 30 on October 6th. Dun, dun, dun. That's right. Krahu from 10 years ago. 20-year-old Krahu. Trying to use a lightweight and not be seen on UAVs. That's where the memory goes, man. Anyway... Uh, I wanted to talk about Black Ops 1 and because, as some of you guys know, it's my favorite it's my favorite Call of Duty from the campaign and the multiplayer. And I just wanted to do like a nice rundown, get you guys some fresh gameplay. Uh, so this is why the quality of this gameplay kind of looks like ass, and I do apologize guys. Um, but I figured, what's, what's second, what, what could I do? What's another thing that I could do to make this um, kind of exciting and nice? Uh, so let's just relive. My, literally my first two games on Call of Duty Black Ops 1, my first two videos. Um, so I wanted to get you guys gameplay uh, a couple of days ago. So my computer fried in this freak fucking storm that happened uh, over the summer. There was a huge lightning strike right outside my window. And I don't know what happened. Well, the power went out. That I know that happened. And then uh, when the power was restored, my network card... Uh, was fried like I could not connect anymore, so I had to get one of those tiny um, Wi-Fi dongles that you um, You know that your computer can have Wi-Fi can detect the signal So I was running on that and then just out of the blue The computer just just died uh, just completely died um, I tried checking what it was, but at this point the computer was very old um, So it was just like god damn it. So I went to work to my office and I got myself the work PC, but the work PC that I have is it's just it can't handle it I tried getting you guys some gameplay before my PS3 took a shit a couple of days ago. That's another fucking story um, And it just blue screened. It, it's just not cut out for that. So guys I am back and this is this is for the long term I, I promise you this is for the long run uh, with YouTube videos and streams But you guys just have to be a little bit more patient with me. I'm saving enough money to get a really good, well, really good, you know, whatever I can afford, uh, but a decent gaming PC for the streams and and just everything that I need so then we can have this next generation season and some retro gameplay, you know, Call of Duty's like this. 
Wow, that camera kind of went psychedelic. Um, so just be a little bit more patient. It's going to take a couple of weeks for me to get the money. Um, but, you know, I'm going to invest it because uh, I really want to be back on, on YouTube and back on Twitch. That's something that I that I really not struggled with, but that's always this yearning. Because, you know, as you grow up, um, you know, real life takes over clearly and you just kind of stop, you know, when you're a YouTuber or whatever, in, in my case at least. Uh, it was like, well, this is nice, so maybe I'll check in every once in a while. And that's kind of what it was. It became one video every week to one video every two weeks to one fucking video a year. Um, and, and I was just like, damn, like, I really miss... I miss doing this, and I really want to want to go back to it, especially with the PS5 dropping. And yes, I do have my uh, PS5 pre-ordered. Thank God, there was a whole thing. Uh, so I'm definitely going to be covering Black Ops Cold War. We're gonna get to Black Ops Cold War soon. But as I was getting, um, trying to get gameplay, trying to connect to record on something, my PS3 took a shit. So that's it. I did do not. I lost my computer. I lost my PS3. I want to go back to YouTube and to Twitch and whatever, and I'm stuck with this crazy setup that I have, but that's okay. <laughs> I will persevere. Um, PS5 is just a couple of weeks away. Hopefully the um, video output will be decent enough so that I can uh, quickly throw in some videos from Black Ops Cold War. Hopefully it's going to do 60 frames per second, not too sure. Um, but that's that's the plan for now, and then once I get my gaming PC, we can begin uh, all the hardcore streams and and just just a good solid like it used to be. You know what I mean. So that's why in the description you will find my Twitch. This wager match was actually the very first gameplay of Black Ops One that I've ever posted on this YouTube channel. Almost 10 years ago, it was on Premiere Day. I think November 9th. It was either November 9th or November 7th that Black Ops One dropped. So almost almost a decade. Holy shit, man. Almost a decade, damn. I forgot that you can't curse on, on YouTube anymore. I'm stuck in like 2015 with the rules, so I, I can't, you know, demonetize, uh, you know, I don't want to get demonetized. I don't fucking monetize my videos, at least I don't think so. This channel has so many cobwebs, I gotta clean up and, and get back into the, into the thick of it. But I'm like, I was planning this video and I had this sick thumbnail designed, you know, I was working on it and then just everything just shut down. Literally a couple of days ago, my PS3 um, crapped out, but that's not going to stop me. So, um, Black Ops Cold War, just to give you guys my brief impressions, I, I did tweet about it, I did post some clips. It was sweaty, it was a very sweaty be beta, but... You know, Call of Duty has evolved so much, when you're watching this video, Call of Duty back then, even when it felt like this felt, oh my god, it's revolutionary. You have gun game, one in the chamber, COD points, um, just, you know, currency or whatever. Oh my goodness, you can wager, you can do this. Like, this was revolutionary back then. And just, you know, new weapons and DLC, whatever. But Call of Duty has evolved beyond that. And that's fine, you know, a lot of people like Modern Warfare uh, 2019. They like Warzone. I guess I'm just old school. Old Man Krahu likes what Old Man Krahu likes. And um, I really want to get a new, uh, not a new PS3, but maybe either fix mine or get like a refurbished one. See what I can do with it. Because I want to stream some old school Call of Duty's as well and go back to them and give you guys a rundown. I think that's fun to watch. And I know it's fun to play for me. I've recently wanted to do Road to um, Commander and Black Ops 1, but that didn't work out. So we'll see. I, I know there's a bright future. So thank you again, guys, for sticking with me and sticking by this channel. Going back to Black Ops Cold War, I will be covering it because I like the game en enough to put a put more time into it. And I put a lot of time into the beta. I did play all the game modes. Oh, well, maybe not the big one, the whatever it's called, the 12v12 or whatever. But all the core game modes I've, I've played. Um, it, it's good, it's good. Again, the skill-based matchmaking is sweaty as fuck. Does it feel like a Black Ops game? It does not. Uh, I do have a Gen 1 PlayStation 4. So the game kind of ran a bit choppy. So I'm thinking if I get the PS5, it's going to run a lot smoother. So that's that's my hope at least. Uh, visibility problems and just, you know, score streak spam. The weird score streak system. We'll talk about it when we go in depth once Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War drops. 
but I just wanted to give you guys some ideas or on what I bitched about on Twitter because um, I am pretty active there especially when you know shit like Call of Duty is in play anyway um, so I did put a lot of time into it. it it just sucks that you know again I do apologize for the quality of this video and this is kind of funny when I was rewatching this I was like mm, what's the zoom on this because that was literally the second game ever of me playing Black Ops 1 ever the one before that was like a mercenary team deathmatch, which I didn't record, and I was like, you know what? Everybody posts like team deathmatches and free for alls and dominations. Nobody posted wager matches, so I posted my very first gameplay was a wager match. So I was just messing around with like snipers and whatever. So this was all brand new territory, ten years ago, haha. Uh -huh. But like I said, um, the reason why I've kind of stopped, you know, uploading. It's just my interest dwindled. It's not the love for the channel or producing videos, because I love that shit, but... You know, after Advanced War, Advanced Warfare just kind of... Was the tipping point, and... As much as... Because I really... I know it sounds weird, but I did love Black Ops 3. Black Ops 4 was okay. Um, it, it just... It, it didn't click for me, you know what I mean? It, it, there was just no spark. But now the spark is back because I feel like Black Ops Cold War has good potential. We just have to unlock it. So I'm going to give a game, the game a chance. But I will focus a lot on streaming because there's a lot more games that I play. I don't only play Call of Duty. In fact, I'm, I'm super excited for Demon's Souls Remastered. If you follow me on Twitter, you know how I freaked out <laughs> when that game was announced back in June. That um, Bluepoint uh, is doing the remake. I, I freaked, freaked. Um, so that's very exciting. So I, I just wanna, I just wanna begin streaming again and and doing YouTube videos, even sharing my thoughts. It doesn't matter how many people watch it. You know, if, if you find yourself, you know, watching my videos, that's fantastic. Thank you so much for coming back. Um, thank you for any ratings and nice comments that you guys, you know, would leave. I'm, I I just miss this so much, and I feel like if I find a good balance between my actual work, my real time, uh, my real uh, job and a good streaming schedule, I think that's going to work out because after work I could put in a couple of hours on streaming and then when once I uh, set up a, a nice schedule, uh, we can go from there. So I'm very excited to be back. Thank you so much for just for being here, guys. I know that I've left you hanging. I, I hope that this year, even though it was crazy as hell, I hope that you guys are safe, healthy, um, and and we're almost through it. I mean, it's not like everything that happened this year expires on December 31st, but if we've made it through 2020, we can make it through anything. I'm just, I just, it's just, feel, it feels so good to have this spark back, you know what I mean? So please be patient with me just a little bit more once I uh, save enough money to get that gaming PC. I think I'm just going to build it. Uh, once I get enough money, I will put it together, I will tweet out my, you know, schedule whatever when my first uh, stream will be but until then I'm going to try to release as often as I can new YouTube videos thank you guys so much for watching I am back this was Krahu and I will see you sexy legends next time take care